guys, this is SD. Wind's picked up just a little bit more. That was taking off pretty good there. Anyway, I'm playing around with the power curve. Trying to get a few amps here and have to try to adjust the voltage here so it'll keep uh, the blade tip speed will keep up and it's a lot of a lot to get uh, set up right just to get the power curve to get the most power out but I just started tinkering around with it let's go in here and we'll see what's happening so far I've been doing all the adjustments on the laptop inside but I haven't been able to watch uh, what the uh, blades are doing we've had a high of 16 miles an hour uh, let's see what that last one was it should takes a while for it to show up on the uh, center right here it's saying four miles an hour and it was faster than four yeah it was eight eight miles an hour what that last gust was anyway uh, here's the charge control see if I can get here to where you can see it all I want to try to see if we can catch uh, some readings, but the wind's been in and out, in and out. It's not nothing straight on. Got a little bit of input right there, and that's a uh, six mile an hour wind right now. So now it's a game of fine tuning. See if we can get everything set right. Not a lot of amps, but I can start playing around with that later on. I increase the uh, gap between the uh, amount of amps I'm asking for versus the volts to let it kind of free spin in there. It's putting a little bit better output right now. That was an 8 mile an hour gust. You can kind of hear the wind out there now. So a little bit more fine tuning and I should just about have it. This is the first day we've really had any any wind at all, so I had something to work with. four mile an hour wind right there yeah earlier the batteries were sitting at uh, 25.3 when the wind first started showing up and uh, blades started moving at four and uh, it was still it wasn't a straight on wind it was cutting in and out and then I got a little bit of seven mile an hour and it actually started showing the input into the battery bank but since I've been playing with the uh, power curve a little bit more now it's starting to make power about four mile an hour. Let's see what the blades are doing. See if it's pitched out of the direction of the wind again. Yeah, it's slowed down quite a bit now. But I got to make that uh, other stator out of uh, that's number fifteen wire. And uh, test that one out too. There she goes. Let's see what kind of input we got on this one. Yeah, I think I'm going to go in there and try to see if I can uh, increase the uh, amp setting by at least one amp uh, for each of the 16 steps. I don't know if a lot of you guys have seen what the uh, Classic has for adjustment, but there's 16 steps that you can adjust both your amperage and your uh, voltage uh, and try to get the most out of your setup there. But it's coming along, guys. Anyway, I'll get this video up so you can all see what's happening. We're getting some power out here. We'll catch you later on.